What's up guys, Austin Nurcho here, back again playing on Ark Survival Evolved here on the Ragnarok Max. So I'm just hanging out here in my house. Um, so I'm going to hop on the RG here real quick. So, f updates from last time. Um, I don't really know that there are any updates. Um, still have the taming pin over there with the dodicker still in it. Still haven't got around to doing that. Um, our crops are going. Still have the uh, frog out here waiting for it. Not waiting for it. Waiting to take it out to get some uh some mini paste with it because i really need some mini paste to work on the next one but we got our griffin here last time as you saw so it's still bloody and powering or healing up and everything so um it's taking a while to get healed up again because i've got hard of it got a play since the last episode so it's just doing look at that little tiny poop it did out this big old thing little tiny poop um still no oil or anything out of the dung beetle i have absolutely no clue what i want to do today um so it looks like everything's pretty good on me. I think I'm going to go, um, do I want to, I don't know if I want to get on the RG or not. I don't know what I want to do. Do I want to take the RG? Because I want to go to the desert and do some uh, drop taming, some of the red drops. I think a Tranodon would be much faster. So I may do that and if I, the only thing is I feel I'm going to like find something I want to tame up or something while I'm out over in this area. Yeah, nothing's good over there. So I'm going to fly to the desert and I'm going to look for some drops and see if I can find anything interesting. And if I do, I'll bring it back. But I'll just kind of do some uh, drop hunting. I can't remember where it is I need to go. Because um, I know there's a thin area. It looks like maybe I'm pointed right at it. Okay. So let's just go up over the mountain. I'll probably freeze to death because I did not bring my fur. I didn't think about that. But hopefully we can make it. But I'll see you once I make it into the desert. Okay, so I found the first one here. So let's. Oh shoot. Oh, maybe not. Got a death worm. So I'll take care of this real quick. Then I'll get the drop. So I'll see you once I finish killing the death worm. I'm just trying to outrun the thing. I didn't end up killing it. Shoot, let's go ahead and get it real quick. Take all. And then we'll look at it and see what we got here real quick. What did we get? We got Ascendant platform oh pariser platform saddle and ascendant scuba lane so that's awesome so i got ascendant stuff here last time but it, it's a rg saddle it takes oh there's a titanosaur or titanosaurus whatever which aren't evil or anything unless you aggravate them but that's cool that just popped in so let's go ahead and find the next drop there's a couple around here in the desert so let's go ahead and find the next ones okay and so i found the second one here so let's see what we got here we'll go ahead and take it and hop on Let's make sure no death worms or anything get on us. Let's see what we got. This time we got uh, an ascendant Uterana saddle and an ascendant Beelzebub saddle. So a frog, which would be good for our frog. But it's crazy how much, um, of course this one takes a lot of hide and fiber, which that would be easy. But the RG one has so much like chitin and keratin that I have to get. Um, so that's cool. So let's now find, I think there's like one or two more maybe around here in the desert. One I couldn't find. I went to the location that's reported and I wasn't able to find it at all. So I'm just uh, flying to all the others. So let's go ahead and find them and I'll bring, bring it back when I find it. So I've been waiting for the drops to respawn back in or at least some of them. Whatever. Oh, come on. So let's pick this up and we'll just go and take it. And I did get another drop also just like a normal uh loot drop or whatever so let's see what we got now so that time we got a moses source out of which is cool and a fur hat oh that's cool it's got a lot of durability on over a thousand durability armor and everything and then from the drop i got this journeyman packy rhino and adobe trapdoor tout need so let's see if i can find any more and if not we'll probably be making our way back home now but let me just check real f quick fly around some more and see if i can find any more so i'll be back if i do so i wanted to interject this so this is technically out of order but i did want to come into the snow cave here because obviously there are a couple of drops in here you can get real easily so i want to fly in and get these real quick hopefully i don't die because of the cold but so far we're not even um, I've got the ice stuff, but this they're pretty easy to find you can see like the lights glowing So the first one's down here low so you could miss this one um, I'm sure everyone that knows <laughs> plays Ragnarok knows about this cave already. I did not um, I had heard about it 
but I did know a donkey saddle, which isn't too bad. I mean, for me, that doesn't have any sort of drops at all. This is, you know, good. Um, so obviously this is like a cave entrance and there's a actual, like, another cave lower down in. Um, but obviously, and there's just a cave full of bears. So you just have to watch out for the bears, which they're not too temperamental. Saber tooth, something or another. Um, but there's yellow and blue drops here Then I assume there's like better loot crates down in the actual cave So I think yeah, there's one over here Yeah, you just got like I said just got to find the drops wherever you see the light glowing. Yeah, there's a blue one but I want to bring the RG in here because it can do a ramshackle hat. That's not too good Because um, it can take care of bears. Yeah, the cave right over there if you need to or can actually go in there for an actual cave but i don't do caves really because i'm too scared and by myself okay there's a drop i think over here follow the lights i keep seeing the lights but i'm not seeing any loot drops oh there's this it's hidden down in here okay and we get ooh, a mammoth saddle and a slingshot. Slingshot. Okay. There's of course the opening right in front of us. Anything else? I can't remember how many drops are supposed to be in here. I don't remember. Ooh, there's a blue one. So the blue ones are hard to find because they like glow or hardly glow any. Gloves. Mastercraft. Gloves. Really? Um, I feel like there should be a thing over there, but it's not glowing. Um, so I think that may be it. Like I said, I don't remember how many things are supposed to be in here. Anything? Oh, the yellow one's back down here. So they could have already spawned back in. We'll just keep checking real quick. Do I see some penguins down in here? Got some more penguins. So we have another spot if we ever need penguins besides the outside area there. What do we got? Anklo and a metal. Or I think that was a better thing, which would be awesome. Let's fly back up and check to see if this one's respawned in or not. Because they must respawn pretty fast back in if they do. Yo, it is back. May have to kill some bears here real quick. So this one we got some fur gauntlets and a packy saddle. So we're just loading up on all sorts of stuff. So let's just keep flying. Like I said, I have a feeling besides down in the actual cave area, I'm like missing something. But I don't know for sure. So let's fly back over here. Because if it has, these things respawn really fast. Oh, it has. Let's see what this one's got. We got a Parasaur saddle. Okay. And let's fly back again. May just be able to make like a whole circle out of this. Just like keep hitting the same ones over and over again. I swear there's one over here. With all the glowing and everything. And I'm not missing it. I don't see, see any. Like I kind of hear a sound. Because they have some sounds. Could just be my headphones though making the noise. But when you get near drops, they have like a humming sound, and that's what I keep hearing in my ears. Let's see, so it looks like that one's not spawned back in yet. So it may be out. Let's check the one back over here. And let's see, does it come back in? No, it has not. So that's pretty much going to be I just wanted to show. Let's go ahead and look at our drops real quick, what we did get out of this so far. Of course, it's not going to be anything near as good. Um, we got a donkey saddle era ascendant donkey saddle ascendant saber two saddle a stone hatchet <laughs> blooper yeah i'm pretty sure we don't need that but it's a mastercraft stone hatchet you never know when you need mastercraft ramshackle hide helmet which is cool a mammoth saddle mastercraft mastercraft slingshot and gloves um a normal ankle saddle which isn't really needed an ascendant um whatever you call a sickle that'll be really good we can switch that out and then we got some um, fur gauntlets, which are good because I need better fur. They got a packy saddle and a parasaur saddle, apprentice, and ascendant, and those. So that is awesome that we did get more drops um, found in here. Like, these are easy to get. Obviously, you just saw me just fly in and get them, and it looks like this one's not come back yet. Uh, but that's going to be it for this part. So I'm going to send it back now to what parts I already recorded because 
saw the video was a little too short, so I wanted to add some more stuff back into it to help kind of add more content into it. And I found out about this cave, and I was like, this is the perfect time to add it. So um, I hope you enjoy the rest of the video. Okay, so I made it back to the base. Let's just go ahead and land over here. And let's go ahead and check. I did get another drop once again. Let's see what all we have here. Um, so we have the saddles, scuba leggings, another, the Uterana saddle, so frog saddle, I would be interested in that. I did kill a bunch of, um, um, whatever you call them, the praying mantis type things. While I was over there, got a bunch of organic polymer, which I don't really need right now, but I have it, and then a bunch of kind to try and craft up, like the saddle, which is just some mini paste, but that's not bad. Then the trapdoor, the pecky rhino saddle, the fur hat, which I do want to make, which I'll need a lot of hair for that, which I don't have. Then we have the Mosasaur saddle, and I got a sword from the praying mantis things. I don't know why I kept it, but and then we got an adobe wall. So this was all from uh, an actual drop here. So we got adobe wall, blueprint, adobe gateway, two wind turbines, which I don't really have anything to use this for, an oil pump blueprint, and then a thorny dragon saddle. So that is all the stuff that we got. So let's go ahead and land here. I don't know if my guy's... No, he's not really that heavy. There we go. I keep having issues getting off and on the RG, so let's, or the Tranodon. So let's come up here. I can't remember if I left it in the um, other, uh, down in the forge or whatever. Oh, no, there it is. RG Blue. Look, I need 7,000 chitin and then a bunch of fiber, which fiber, like I said, is not that hard to get. We'll go and grab that with us. Then we can go and put, I don't need the parasaur. I'm interested in those. Don't need. No, the saddle stays here. This, that one. Put that that um, blue fur. We'll keep the fur. Then we'll put these in there as well. There we go. And um, I did see the simple pistol. It does have a lot of quite a bit of damage to it as well. I may make this and try and use that as a gun. Um, but I don't think there's anything else I'm really interested. I do have some ghillie there that I've collected over the time. Um, now we need to drop off. We'll go ahead and drop off some of this stuff in here. We'll drop off the turbines um, And then we need to do we'll just put the saddles in here. I have another place, but it may be filling up So all of that those items are what I'm interested in crafting up. So let's go ahead Grab the RG real quick. I can't remember. I think I dumped all the Kite and keratin off unless it's on the RG here, but I don't think so just see if we can craft any of this. If not, we'll move on to something else. Because I had it all on here. Nope. Okay, so let's take a look. Uh, stuck on the tail. Can't remember. I believe it's crafted in here. No, it's not in there. Like I said, I have absolutely no clue what I did with all of it. Is it in here, maybe? Got the organic polymer. I don't remember what I did with all the tightening or the care whatever stuff um i don't know i may have put it on something else i don't remember but we need oh so it just made in your inventory right rg saddle yeah it doesn't say anything so oh yeah i let's all in the bird i forgot about that and it's not in there um i don't remember what i did with um let me try and find it real quick and i'll be right back Okay, so I got everything put into here now so I can finally craft up this RG saddle. So let's go ahead and craft it. Oh, craft one. There we go. And that took so much. Look, I only have 80 kind left, a bunch of fiber, and that much hide left out of this whole thing. That took so much. I hope this RG... Uh, now watch, I'm going to go get with the RG killed like right away or something. So that's awesome. So we got that. We'll go ahead and take our blueprint back just so we don't forget it. And we'll take all this stuff too. So we can put it back in our chest of stuff or whatever, our storage. Okay, so let's put it on the RG. Like I said, I like to craft all that stuff, but there's no way. Um, I have uh, whatever room or whatever and stuff for, or I don't know what I'm even saying. So we now have an RG saddle. Of course, we have no, absolutely no clue what it looks like on it or what it's doing so it's got 136 armor i have no clue if that's good or not but i assume since it's an ascendant that means it's pretty good and then we have a crafting skill bonus i guess i don't know i don't know what it even means but it's fine with me but we finally got our nice rg saddle crafted up so that is awesome i don't know what else small we could do today of course i need to get bugs but once again i'm out of time maybe let's go uh trank this 
um, whatever, Dodicarus app real quick. And then I'll have that tamed for next, uh, tamed up for next episode. So let's re fly over here and do this real quick to end off the episode and knock out the Dodicarus here. So let's come over. Yep, it's still over here. Watch. I'll probably like do this and then find a better one because I think it's a 140 female or something. So it's not that great. But let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and shoot it in the head to start out with. But we'll go ahead, or it keeps walking away the other way. But let's go ahead and pow right in the kisser. So I'm hoping not to have it attack my walls and stuff because they are wood and I have the damage turned on. Which in the past the damage wasn't on. Oh no, it's a 130 Dodickers. Which it's not like I'm going to use it for anything. But I'm going to get this knocked out real quick and I'll bring it back to end off the episode. Okay, so it got knocked out so let's go ahead and put the berries in it to get it tamed up. Go ahead and stick our stack of 100 in there. So that's going to be it for this episode. I'll just let this tame up for next episode. But that's going to be it for this episode of Ark Survival Evolved here on the Ragnarok map. Let's see if I can... Whoop. Looking in at you. Um, of going out and getting drops out in the desert. I was hoping to get a lot more, but I only found, what, three, uh, four maybe at most. Four... Uh, drop some most and of course some other things but I did get some good stuff obviously and I got the Archie saddle all crafted up and then we also have the fur hat that I need to get crafted up because I need way better fur because I freeze every time I go in the cold but I hope you enjoy this short episode of just doing some drop hunting and getting some stuff all crafted up and everything and by thank you for watching please leave a thumbs up if you did enjoy and don't forget to subscribe to see more arc videos and we'll see you next time